Connect the power cord to the power supply. Connect the power supply to an AC power source. Verify the indicator is illuminated. Set the printer power switch to off. Connect the power supply to the printer. Use the scratch test to verify media type. A dark streak indicates direct thermal media. No ribbon needed. No streak indicates thermal transfer media. You will need a ribbon. Loading media. Open the printer. Verify the media sensor is in the correct location for label media. Remove the outside wrap from the media roll to prevent contamination. Place the label media in the roll holders. Pull the media out the front of the printer. Push the media under both of the media guides. Close the printer. Loading transfer ribbon. The printer supports two zebra ribbon types, 74 meter and 300 meter ribbon lengths. Use genuine zebra ribbons to assure proper operation. Do not use ribbon cores with damaged notches. Using unapproved or damaged ribbon cores may allow the ribbon to slip. Slip can cause ribbon wrinkle, poor end of ribbon sensing, intermittent failures, and poor print quality. Loading 300 meter ribbon. Ribbon supply spindle. Ribbon take up spindle. Install the supply ribbon on the spindles. Install the empty take up core on the spindles. Release the ribbon leader. Pull the ribbon leader up past the printhead and attach to the take-up core. Wind the take-up spindle towards the rear of the printer until the ribbon reaches the take-up core. Close the printer. Loading 74 meter ribbon. Remove the wrapper from the ribbon supply. Release the ribbon leader. Install the ribbon on the supply spindle. Install the empty ribbon core on the take-up spindle. Pull the ribbon leader up past the printhead and attach to the take-up core. Wind the take-up spindle towards the rear of the printer until the ribbon reaches the take-up core. Close the printer. Calibrate the media. Turn the printer power on. After the status light turns green, Press the feed button to expel a few labels. Press and hold the feed button until the status light flashes once, followed by a pause between flashes. Release the feed button after the status light flashes twice. The printer will calibrate for label length and media sensing levels. When the printer has finished calibrating the media, the status light will turn green to show printer ready. Print a configuration report to verify printer operation. Press and hold the feed button until the status light flashes once. Release the feed button. A configuration report will print. Printer configuration printout. A network configuration printout is included when the Ethernet option is installed. 
Connect to the host interface. Set the power switch to off. USB interface. Serial interface. Secure the connector to the printer. Parallel interface. Secure the connector to the printer. Optional wired Ethernet interface. Insert and verify the connector is secured. Install the software and run Zebra Setup Utilities. The software will prompt you when to switch power on to complete installation.